second one I've lost. I didn't set the hook. Finally, well, we're only 10 minutes in, I guess. Welcome to Webster Lake. And I even see people trolling for muskie, which surprises me in this warm weather, but there we go. There's number one on the chatterbait. Let's see how this day goes. We're about to get another, about to get another one. There it is. There's a bunch right here. Two different ones hit it, and of course, the little guy got it. And he's gonna jump all around. There we go. Oh, he's a pirate. He's a pirate. Oh. Ooh, there's another one. There's one right there. We'll get him with the. We'll get him with the wacky rig if it, if he don't bite this chatterbait again. Told you. You always get him with the wacky rig. It's a little guy, but I wanted to get him. There's a good fish. There we go. Found one offshore finally. We ain't far offshore though. And I at least set the hook on him, but God, my drag is so loose. That's a good sized fish. Damn, that's a long boy. Good sized fish. Smoked it too. Ah. Listen, I'm being so gun shy lately on these fish because they have been sticking me. Jeez. Nice hook set on the chatterbait. That's all I'm doing right now. It's trying to get an idea of. Just trying to get an idea of whereabout they are. It's about five foot of water. Skinny little, just a long male. That's good fish. We'll take it. And that's our. That's all right. We got uh, what four or five bites already. I've only got three fish in, but. Not rocket science. I'm out here where everything kind of funnels together and just casting. I got the trolling motor set on uh, cruise and I'll stop if there's a fish, cast a few times, keep going in the, if, there, if there's no bites. That's it. Not a lot to it. This looked like a good little spot. Nothing serious, but this thing got bit four or five times. Finally, this little guy ate it. So we'll sit here for a second in between a couple points and see if we can't make something out of it. Nice weed bed. Not super familiar with this lake, but I'm doing what I would normally do on any lake. Find a point, an offshore point or a weed line, fish it as you're trolling and until you start getting bites. Use your favorite search bait, whatever it may be. Chatterbait seems to be one of everybody's favorites. Spinnerbait's my favorite, but when it's sunny like this, I don't have a whole heck of a lot of success with the spinnerbait. There we go. Told you we were going to catch something here. buddy 
All right. Thank you, sir. Hooked the shit out of him. His lip's bleeding. That's rare. Golly, why are they so active? Phew. Sorry about that, bud. Still kind of searching out a good bite. Haven't found one. That's a good size keeper fish, though. 15 inch fish. Uh, yeah, slinging the chatterbait. That's pretty much what I'm doing right now. Here pretty soon, uh, if I stop getting bites, I've caught a little fish here and there. Uh, if I stop getting bites, then I'm, I'm gonna start frogging. I'm trying to find a good bite outside of frogging, but we'll see how it goes. Size fish. Easy, bud. Still doing the same thing. Just moving. Nothing exciting. Could have been worse. Barely a keeper. We've caught nothing big yet. A couple decent sized ones, but I'm still just doing the same thing. It's still early. We've only been here two and a half hours, and I got, I don't know, six or seven fish. A few keepers. One fairly nice one, so. That's a good fish. That's a much better fish. Keep him down. There we go. I thought we might find something here. Much better fish. It feels like a giant because I've caught a lot of 12 inches today. It's a good fish. Oh yeah. A little heavy fish, but he's only about 16 inches maybe. Good, broad, nice fish. 15 incher, felt like a stud. There's another. Sorry, bud. There's gonna be a lot of pirates here after I leave. He's probably 13. I was talking to the camera, but the camera wasn't on. All right, well, that's it for the morning bite. I've been here three hours. I found some fish basically doing what I know how to do pretty good, which is weed edges and points and wind blown points. Uh, but I didn't get nothing big. I basically, I mean, I threw four or five baits. But I basically got everything on the wacky rig and most everything on the uh, chatterbait, which is something everybody has tied on most of the time. Good search bait. Uh, never really found anything what I could stick and sit still doing. So I got a tea time this afternoon. We're gonna head back up and see if we can't get a frog fish or two and call the day. Nothing impressive so far. Decent day, fun day fishing, but we gotta get at least a couple bigs from a frog. Then we'll call it a, a success. So stuttering probably screaming every day i get off to go fishing 30 mile an hour wind what are you gonna do daydreaming I ain't gonna lie that's a tank too that's an absolute tank I'm telling you I was not ready I I'm lucky I set the hook on him just cranking 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 I probably made 400 casts oh that's a stud that is an absolute stud right in the top of the mouth whoa almost hooked myself there he is that's probably a three pounder good fish that's a good one Late morning, it's almost noon, and I'm getting ready to start frogging on my way out of here. He knocked himself silly, it's not my fault. Of 
perfectly healthy. picture of it and grab it and it kicked off as a three and a half pounder guaranteed guaranteed I don't know what I was doing I don't know why I didn't get the net I'm not really heartbroken about it it wasn't a giant but it's a three and a half pounder that I can promise you that was stupid I'm not happy about it and I had the camera off and everything so you didn't even get to see the hook set maybe the back camera got it well that's it not a very exciting day not a very exciting day at uh, Webster. I could have done a lot better. But the most exciting part was I did stick two three-plus pounders in a row. And I let one get away at the boat. But whatever. Uh, I tried to make a frog thing happen, but couldn't make it happen. I thought that would save the video. But it didn't. Basically, I just caught a handful of bass. So I appreciate you watching it. Wasn't that exciting. Till next time.